This is a clip from the song Mouse Hole by the Iranian rapper Tumaj Salehi. The lyrics are derived from slogans chanted during anti-government demonstrations. Salehi went from protesting with his music to actively participating on the streets. He's been arrested on charges of encouraging acts of violence and riots. This is another song, Yes It Is, by well-known rapper Hitchcast. Near Tehran's Azadi Square, the lyrics have been turned into expressive movements that sum up protesters' demands. Protest songs are needed in society because they give us some momentum. At times like this, I don't listen to any other genres of music. The most important thing about a protest song is the feeling it evokes in you and the effect it has on you. You can listen to a protest song in many different styles of music. Shervin Haji Agapur wrote the song that is perhaps most recognizable. He previously took part in a local talent show. The lyrics of his song, For the Sake of, are inspired by the demands circulated on social media. It's the most played melody in public spaces. Protest music in Iran began before the constitutional revolution at the beginning of the last century, where musicians used it to demand justice and civil rights. Protest music is a kind of peaceful protest without creating any tension in society. The Bella Chao song is still very much alive. It was chanted by workers in rice paddy fields in Italy during World War II to complain about harsh conditions. Today's Farsi version is just as critical of authorities. When music is used to protest on these streets, the usual melodic rules may not be as important. The words and slogans take precedence over rhythm to ensure that the message is universal. Dorsa Jabari, Al Jazeera, Tehran.